And let's go back to London to continue our breaking news coverage about Queen Elizabeth's health. We have new images of the royal family arriving at Balmoral, including Prince William and Prince Andrew seen here in a car arriving. NBC's Molly Hunter joins me now from our London bureau. Uh, welcome back to our live coverage. Uh, Molly, let's talk about the arrival of the royal family. You can see Prince Andrew with, in the front seat, Edward. Prince Edward. Yeah, that's back. right. And you see Prince William. Yeah. In those pictures, you see Prince William actually driving uh, his uncles in that car. That is the last contingent, Andrew, we believe, of her children arriving at Balmoral. We knew that Prince William was traveling up without his wife, Kate, and without their children. We also believe, Andrea, that Prince Harry is traveling up separately uh, from Prince William and their uncles, but that he is also heading up. Uh, the Duchess of Sussex, Meghan, is staying here in London. Just bringing your audience back up to uh, speed, we have not heard anything new from Buckingham Palace since that original statement. I'm just going to uh, read it out one more time because it is so extraordinary. It was unprompted. It was not released in response to a cancellation of an event. It was not released in response to kind of uh, any uh, big uh, engagement that we expected to see the Queen at today. It said, following further evaluation this morning, the Queen's doctors are concerned for Her Majesty's health and have recommended she remain under medical supervision. The Queen remains comfortable and at Balmoral. So, Andrew, we believe that with that car uh, that Prince William is driving, the rest of her children will be there. This is serious. Not only was the palace signaling to the country that this was serious earlier with that statement, but the fact that her family have flown up to be with her at this time. Uh, we're not going to speculate, of course, but suggest uh, that this really is quite serious and that the rest of the country is certainly watching with increasing uh, alarm and concern.